He is. Yes, he is. The heck have I got on? Folks, welcome to another episode of Action Angling. I've been out for a while. Well, you may not see it in the videos because they've only been spaced apart like four or five days. I've been using videos that were in the bank. I always try to keep three videos done ahead in case situations like the past week have happened. And uh, so I had uh, problems with my back. I don't know. <clears throat> Pretty much couldn't get off the couch for a week. Still went to work, but... Uh, yeah, it was uh, it was pretty painful, but today I'm feeling a little bit better. It's not 100%, but uh, good enough. I could tie my shoes, I can walk around the house, and uh, I can go fishing. I hope. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not pressing it too much, but I only got a couple hours anyway. I'm at this little pond. It is uh, an abandoned, abandoned, or just decommissioned. I don't know. It's Anyways, it's a conservation area pond. But uh, it's not maintained. And uh, fished it a few times. Never really caught too much. I, there's a lot of variety. But I never caught anything really big out of it. But uh, let's go give it a shot. I mean, there's got to be something big in here. It's deep enough and, and has enough different uh, diversity of species to hold maybe a big bass. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if we can find out if there's something bigger than the norm. If not, let's go catch a bunch of fish. It's been eight days. Let's go catch a bunch of fish. Today in Action Angling. Alright. Off we go. Right into the tree. Seems pretty dark out here. It's because I'm in between storms. Hopefully I got a couple hours before the next one what the weather network said but uh you know being a meteorologist is pretty much just getting paid to guess these days we'll see i'm not too far from the car if i gotta run for it and if there's a big lightning storm i get a great clickbait title for my video all right i'm at the pond and there's thunder so that's good there we go i'm gonna get my clickbait title i died while fishing Above a spillway? I got a fish, guys. Went too long. Even though I can make five or six casts, I'm good. I'm gonna try a little popper. A little micro popper. It's screaming top water to me right now. If there's any base here. Oh, there's a turtle. There's a fish. Awesome. Awesome. On the popper. That's my first topwater fish this year. First topwater bass, I think. Anyway. He's only little. But that is awesome. Ow. Little hooks, little hooks. Alright. Got a topwater bass. That's okay. You don't need to be huge. It's a hell of a way to break the streak. Is there another one over there? And literally right away. Oh my gosh. Another bass. I think. I'm liking that little rip wrap spot over there, but I think I'm gonna run out of fish soon. Yeah, another beautiful little largemouth. Smoking the popper. Classics. You can't beat the classics. Little rebel popper. In the ultralight size. I just had a feeling that was going to get bit. Starting to rain pretty good here. I think it's time to take the top water off. It might be time to run, maybe. All right, piss pouring rain, but I don't hear no thunder, so I'm gonna keep going. I'm pretty sure I know what's gonna happen when I throw a worm in there, but uh, let's find out. I know the sunfish were kind of out from this deep spot, so I'm just gonna drop this in the deep spot and see if it gets a bite. I can't even see my line through all the damn rain. 
Not a damn thing. Now watch this. Watch this. Gas over that way. And still nothing happening. Okay. Thought the sunfish would be all over that. <laughs> nothing here. And the sunfish. Oh, there they are. Yep. Uh-huh. Bluegill. What a surprise. Okay, shit. That thunder was really close. Um. Shit. If there's one more clap like that, I'm gonna go at least hide in the car. I don't know, there hasn't been any more thunder for a little bit, knock on wood. Did not get a bite in the deep spot, I don't know why. Nothing at all. Oh, there's thunder. Oh my god. What am I doing? How badly do I want to keep catching bluegills? Alrighty. Little crick hopper. I figure if a grasshopper lands in here, it wouldn't last long. See if that does the trick for anything different. Or the same. Something. It's a tiny bluegill. Super aggressive though. And it's pissing down rain again. Oh, I wasn't recording. Damn it. Got a little crappie. I knew there was some crappies in here. He freaking smoked it hard too. He didn't fight hard, but he hit it really hard. Little black crappie. Or just use corn, because I'm pretty sure it would have got one with corn. Okay, where the hell is this thunder coming from? It sounds so close to me. I'm almost done here anyway. Unfortunately, I gotta take off soon. Holy crap. It's a really good bite. I don't know if he's on it or not. He is. Yes, he is. What the heck have I got on? It is a bullhead! <laughs> Big one. For a little pond. Long one anyway. And I think if I can get a better look at him here. Oh no, 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 no. Um, might be a yellow bullhead, but I'm not 100% sure. These are slightly less common, especially in ponds, but around here anyway. Cool. Well, whip out the old crick hopper a few more times and then time to leave. Storm is just about right above me. It's pretty much time to go anyway. This fish. What do we got? Is it another base? It is. Oh, there's another large faced base. Oh, God. Oh, crappy. The old stop and go. I'll tell you, when the crappies hit it, they hit hard. I think it's a bigger fish than they are. Little black crappie. Isn't he pretty? He is pretty. Super shiny. Holy cow. Jeez, had to be another crappie. They just smoke it so hard. Literally pulled drag when he hit. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, they hit it so hard. It's all these little crappies. Oh. Every time I 
think it's going to be a big bass. It's about the only size of crappie I've ever caught in here. It's little tiny five, six inch ones. Yeah, storm's right above me. I spent way too much time playing with those tiddly little crappies, which was fun. But uh, I'm going to pay for that, so i got to sleep. It's hard when you haven't fished in eight days, pretty much. It's hard to leave when you can finally get out again, but yeah. I think that's it. Damn you, zucchini. Did have some bites on it again, but I don't know. Doesn't seem to hook them. Oh, geocache. Okay. I'll take that. People still geocache? I had a friend who was into geocaching. I didn't find it all that great, but he liked it. Whatever floats your boat, man. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I told you if I fish and I catch fish, I'm going to film it. I'm going to post it. So, yeah. No epic giant catches today. Big fish of the day, a uh, freaking bullhead. Might have been a yellow bullhead though, but uh, you know what? After sitting inside for eight days, that was fun. I had a good time. I think now I'm like, my back just feels like my muscles are weak, which, hell, I haven't been using it for eight days. So yeah, they, they, they probably are. But uh, yeah, it was okay. Got a couple of topwater bass. Can't complain about that. They might've been tiny little babies, but uh, topwater bass is topwater bass. Anyways, if you like this video, or better ones, <laughs> then uh, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and if you haven't, please consider subscribing to my channel. I love you. Hope you have a great day. Chop, chop.